I'm at the grocery store because what else is new? I just, I have to pick something up that I forgot. But uh, what a difference it makes when you have winter tires on your car. Like normally I would have never driven after a snowstorm. It wasn't even really that. I mean, where I live, anyway, some places got bad. But anyways, I was like, you know what? I think it's going to be fine. And the roads were fine. They were basically bare at this point. But like, I love my winter tires. I, cause before, like no matter what, like no matter what was on the road, I was sliding everywhere. And now it's like, it's pretty good. So I'm a big fan of winter tires. Let's open some Advent. I think I'm going to start with, uh, planner stickers. Cause it's my fave. <laughs> Maybe I'll let you guys see first this time. I don't think I've done that for you guys yet. And then I'll, I can try to guess. So I think there's one sheet in there. Oh my God, I guess. I don't know. It's some sort of like labels, like words, like to do or to get or something. <gasps> no, oh my gosh. This is so perfect. This is my favorite sheet. I this is exactly oh I love it. Oh I love it so much. Here. Look, 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 look. Don't mind the clutter. Um this is exactly oh I took my nail polish off last night to give my nails a bit of a look at them, they're all like stained from painting. Donate toys. Oh stop. That's so cute. Go for a sleigh ride, snowball fight. Like, like, well, you guys can read it. But look, I use stickers like this. Like, I've bought stickers like this from her. And I've used multiple sheets of these. Like, not, I've never seen this one. But she's had other ones. Like, I use these type of stickers all the time on my planner. And you know what? I hate my handwriting. Like, I have really messy penmanship. If you've ever received a Christmas card from me, <laughs> you know this. But... I like when I don't have to write things out. I can just put like spring cleaning down and I don't have to actually write because I hate my writing. This is so good. This is the best sheet yet. Number 14 for after eight. Let's see. I think it's one of those nuggets things again. Yeah, I got another one of these. They're really, really good. I want to show you guys what Florence got in her advent calendar today. That is by far the best thing you've gotten so far, I think. I like this one. Oh yeah, you also got that. That's pretty too. Thank you, need to know. <laughs> you're gonna give it to your friend? Boyfriend? Stop <laughs> I'm, saying I'm that. Kidding. You're so weird. No, I'm not weird. Um, I'm working on this one now. Are you gonna give this one to your friend? What? Are you gonna give this one to your friend? My your little friend? My boyfriend? Your boyfriend? I, I should get a boyfriend. You're a special friend? Maybe I need a boyfriend. I'll call up Zach Hansen. <laughs> oh, thank you. The kids have no school again today because of the snow, but it's really nice out right now. It's not bad at all. But what do you think? Look at this one. What do you think of the snow? What do you think of all that snow? It's nail time. And I'm going to close my eyes. <laughs> I like being surprised. Do we have a glitter? Do we have a glitter? It feels like a glitter. Okay, one, two, three. I mean, it's a chrome. <laughs> We're getting there. Go big or go chrome. Nice. Uh, yeah. We'll see how it looks. I'm not sure how I think yet. The nails. I like these better than the goldish ones. I like the silver ones better, but I don't know if I would like gravitate toward this color, but it's not bad. Uh, but I think I want to make Christmas crack today. I was watching Carol from Raising Rayburns, which I'll link her channel down below. She is by far one of my favorite creators to watch here on YouTube. I just feel like whenever you turn into her videos, it's like, you're catching up with a friend like she just I don't know it's something about her videos to me are like comfort videos like I and I told her that before in her comments and I'm like is that weird to say but like I don't know it's just something about like some watching her videos it like makes me feel comfort <laughs> so I don't know <laughs> that might be weird 
but she just has a very like homey cozy like is she I don't know it's just like you kind of feel like you're her friend I I just I really like her videos a lot she's doing vlogmas and she was making Christmas crack the was it yesterday's video maybe it was yesterday I don't well it won't be yesterday for you guys but um, she's making Christmas crack and it was, I've never seen it made before. I've heard of it and I think I've had it before, but I've never actually like seen it made before. And it is so simple. <laughs> it's like, is that all you have to do? I can do that. And I have all of the ingredients. So I'm like, I think I'm going to freaking make Christmas crack today and see how that goes. It's Wednesday. So Wednesday dinner, which is, I feel like all of Vlogmas we haven't had to have. We I haven't really got to show you guys like Sunday dinners or Wednesday dinners because like we've all been sick. But it's Wednesday dinner. So Florence has her boyfriend over for supper. Well, he's here now, but over for supper. And then my mom's coming for supper. Uh, my sister's coming for supper. I don't know if my dad's coming. If he's not, then I'll send him home a plate. But like... um, Yeah, so it's gonna be... We're gonna have a big supper. I'm just making spaghetti because I'm like... Ugh, like I feel like everyone likes it so we're just gonna have that and then I thought maybe we could like my Christmas crack will be like a tester so we we can eat that for dessert and see how it is maybe so I think I'm gonna make that very very soon so it has time to like set and do whatever it has to do I have to rewatch Carol's video and like watch her do as I'm very good at like if someone's like doing something like I follow along better visually than reading it so um, I'll probably rewatch her video like five times to make the Christmas crack, but I'm excited. I'll show you guys it uh, for sure because it looks really, really good. So we're going to do that. But yeah, our power came back on yesterday at like supper time because we ended up making tacos for supper yesterday. We were kind of like, oh, I guess we have to order out because we don't have power, but the power came back on like right at supper time and it stayed on so that was good so we ended up having power for the rest of the evening and then uh that was our evening we didn't really we had a pretty chill evening and then okay so we're going on a cruise in february and before the like the cruise sails out of florida uh like the around the orlando ish area i forget port canaveral port Canaveral or Carnarvon or something so it's around that area and uh we want to do a day at Disney when we we were going to do a day at Disney before the cruise because we're flying in a couple days before the cruise because obviously we live in Canada like there's a lot that can go wrong with your flights in the winter time and uh we just don't want to risk not arriving on time so we like to fly in a few days before so there's wiggle room we were going to go to disney the day before the cruise but we looked into it last night like trevor was doing research and that weekend is president's day weekend in america and apparently that's a really busy weekend in disney and like everyone's like blog posts and videos and just like all the research we were doing last night was saying like stay away from Disney on President's Day weekend. It is so busy. It's comparable to Christmas, they said. I don't know if this is all true. I can I can totally see that being true. And I were like, ooh, like we don't wanna like we're literally spending one day at Disney and that's it. Like that's all we have time for. Disney's very expensive. Like we just did a whole big universal trip. So like we're we're, we're only doing one day. And we're like, we don't want to have our one day at Disney to be like the most packed it will be. Like, it's just, we're like, no. So I think we're actually going to do Disney on the way home. So the day we sail in, I think we're going to go right. Because you have to get off the ship like at the crack of dawn. Because they have to get it all ready for the next people to come on the ship. So you're like off the ship like by like between like 7 and 8 a.m. Maybe even earlier. I don't even remember. But like, it's very, very early. So we're going to basically go straight from the ship to um disney and we have a hotel booked so uh we don't fly out to the next day so we're just going to drop our bags off at the hotel and then go to disney for the day and that day that we're going has a low crowd day people predict them i guess i don't really know trevor was looking all into it the day that we're going it's not like a 
it's not in the red like there's like colors there's like red green orange or something it's not in the red red is like busy like don't go i forget what it was it was like a lower crowd day for that day so we're gonna actually go that day so we figured all that out last night which was a huge like stress off us because we were like oh no like what are we gonna do like should we even bother doing disney like what's the point of going if like well to me there's always a point in going but like trevor's like <laughs> we will not want to stand in lines all day long after a full day of travel and i get it because like that's the mistake we made with universal we had it's a long travel day for us to get anywhere from the island it's a long travel day because like we don't fly off the island we have to drive and we're flying out of a completely different airport that in a different province like we are flying out of an airport we've never even seen before um because it was like so much cheaper to fly out of this one airport so we're like we have to do like a three-ish hour drive to catch our flight and then it's a full day of travel to florida <laughs> unfortunately I miss the days with the direct flights. We used to have direct flights from the island and they were so, like you would be in Florida in a couple hours. Like that's unheard, like that, that literally doesn't even exist for us anymore. It's a full day of travel to go anywhere. <laughs> it's so stupid. <laughs> Living on the island is so beautiful and it's so nice and it's like, oh, I love it so much, but it has its cons for sure things are so expensive here and like to fly off the island is just stupid expensive so you like you just never do it so anyway we have to anyway what i'm saying is it's gonna be a long travel day and then when we went to universal we had that long travel day and then we got up at the crack of dawn to go to the park for park opening and we were zonked <laughs> we're so zonked so it's gonna be nice to not do that this time we'll take that day and maybe just like explore at a slower pace around the Orlando area, not um, going straight to a park, you know? Anyways, long-winded. This has been a long clip, hasn't it? I think I'm gonna go make some Christmas crack, but look, cute, right? I, I like them. I don't know. I think I would like it on like an accent nail. I don't know. No, they're, they're cute, they're cute. Oh, and I use the top and I use the start to finish on the bot on the base coat and I use it as a top coat as well just to see how it does as a top coat because it's been many years since I've used that. So I had the ingredients on hand, but this is what so you use saltine crackers. I didn't have parchment paper, but I just did what Carol did and <laughs> sprayed my thing down my pan. I had an awkward space here, so I just like crumpled some there. So you just line the bottom there. And then you're gonna boil down these two things of butter, like a cup of butter. Let's add brown sugar to it, a little bit of vanilla, and then yeah, well, I'll show you this. But this is all you need. And you just melt down the butter. Once your butter's boiled down, a cup of brown sugar. Once your butter and your brown sugar is all boiled together and you pour it on top. This is my first time ever doing this. So. It's already hardening. <laughs> okay, and then you're gonna put this all in the oven for a few minutes and let it cook on there, I guess. Then when it comes out of the oven, you sprinkle chocolate chips on it. And you just spread all this with a knife once it's melted. <gasps> this is so easy. I bet you this is gonna be so good. Okay, I gotta concentrate, guys. I'll show you in a second. Welcome back to Sanders Advent Calendar. Today is day 14. 11 more days and the big jolly guy will be coming to our house. So day 14. I just hope he doesn't bring me any cheese. <laughs> I'll be pretty tired of cheese by then. It's a white cheese. Let's see. And it's called Applewood. Oh, that's the one I might need to cheat a cracker with. Yeah, 
really smoky. Mm. I don't even think your cracker will do this any justice. We'll try it. It's eatable with a cracker, but still not my favorite. I think I would have to give it maybe a five out of 10. Okay, let's see if we can wash that down with some chocolate. So day 14 is, ooh, 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 where's my day 14? That's the hardest part of the advent calendar is finding the dates. 14, oh, there's 14 right here. See which one I get today. Oh, it's the double decker bus. I think this is my favorite one. Mmm, delicious. 10 out of 10. Till tomorrow, guys. Bye. So, this is the Christmas crowd. I just put a few red sprinkles on it. <laughs> so, I guess you just break it apart now. And then serve it like that. Who wants to try some tea? Do you want to open my tea? No, you can do it. No. <laughs> she goes, no. Okay. Okay. Oh, you need some more blankets? Let's see. Mom's going to try the tea with me today. 14. Day, thank you. Okay, guess what it is, Mom. <gasps> Candy cane something? No. Cocoa? No, it's called jelly donut. Ooh, what that. do you mean, ew? Mmm, <laughs> smells like fruity. Can I, can I do a question like this? Sure. You think it smells nasty? Jelly donut like has cream. no caffeine. It has apple, rubus, raisin, <coughs> beetroot. Yeah. This might not be the best one for you, Mom. <laughs> Why Can't be worse than the apple wood cheese. Okay, question of the day is, what's your favorite Christmas movie? And what's your favorite Christmas gift that you ever got? What's so two, yours? Pair of Christmas gift was going to Florida with, and going to WWE. Yeah. And then... That was probably like six years ago now? Yeah. And then my favorite Christmas movie has to be either um, Home Alone, either The Grinch or The Polar Express. Nice. Yeah. This is the jelly donut. Do you want cheers? Cheers. Okay, um. Logmas. <laughs> oh. What? Oh. My goodness. What? What's wrong with it? Mom? Huh? You don't like it? Can you say that? No. Oh. <laughs> you, okay. <laughs> it's sour. Oh, here. Do you want to record me? Can you see me? Yeah. You see my tree? Yeah. Yeah, for sure. What does it taste like? It tastes like a jelly donut. Um, like the yeah. filling of a jelly donut, but it doesn't work with tea. No. Do you think? It tastes like lip gloss. Uh, Do you think? It tastes like dishwater. Mom. Oh, is my phone ringing? What is she doing? Molly, what the heck? You want to snuggle with me? Oh, you want to snuggle with me? It's like they were in Florida. She likes to kiss. Is that what she did when we were in Florida? Is it? I don't want to put the flash on and wake her. Look at her. This is what she always does to me. I know. Oh, I think she missed you. Yeah. I completely forgot to show you guys the spaghetti, but you guys know what that looks like. It went over really well. Everybody loved it. Well, I'm gonna do my puzzle and then tomorrow, okay, maybe I'll end the vlogmas with the puzzle. I don't know if I've ever done that before. I just feel like talking right now. Then I'll do the puzzle, but tomorrow I have such a busy day and I'm so excited. Like tomorrow's like full blown Christmas. Like I'm going out tomorrow and I am going to finish my Christmas shopping. And like, 
I am not coming home until I am done. Because, like, I don't have, like, I have to just buy gift cards. That's, like, all I have left to buy. Like, I'm buying a few, uh, well, I shouldn't say, I don't know who watches my videos. <laughs> I always assume nobody in the world watches my videos. Like, I always just assume nobody's watching. And, um, and then, like, I'll be somewhere and then, like, I run into somebody that I know and they're like, oh yeah, I seen that in your video. I seen that in your video. I'm like, you freaking watch my videos. <laughs> so I, I shouldn't be selling people's gifts if I don't know who's watching, but I have to pick up a few gift cards. And so I'm one, two, one, two, three, I have three gift cards to buy. And I got to get my dad some, like I have a few little things for my dad, but like, I just want to get him something else. And then I got to get my mom something i have her, same thing though i got her a few little things like normally i buy them like a big thing but this year i don't have like a big thing for them like i've been just kind of buying them like just things i don't know so i feel like i, I don't they don't expect they don't expect a big thing or like a lot of things but like i just feel like i need to get them like one more thing <laughs> Um, so I gotta get them something and then I have to, okay, did I explain this to you guys yet? The stockings in my family, we draw names for stockings, all of the adults. And so in my family, there's me, Trevor, my sister, my brother, my sister-in-law, my mom and my dad. So there's seven adults and out of the seven adults, we every thanksgiving we put our name into a hat and draw names for a stocking you have to buy a stocking for the name that you drew this year i drew my sister-in-law and trevor drew my dad so we're gonna have to buy them a stocking and the rule is you have to put 10 things in the stocking and there's no like price limit but it's stocking stuff it's not anything big so you have to put 10 things in each stocking and you have to wrap all 10 things. So everything is wrapped in the stocking. And then on Christmas Eve, we all get together and we um, take turns opening our stocking. So like we'll open the stockings one at a time. Who's coming down here? Oh, it's Alex. Um, we'll, we take turns opening the stocking and then we'll like all watch the person opening their stocking. And it's so much fun. We've done this for, I don't, 16 17 years now since like right before florence was born like whenever like me and my brother and sister became adults i think it's when we kind of started i don't remember when this tradition started but i have to finish by my sister-in-law stocking what's on my hand i was i put a new garbage bag in the garbage anyway oh the christmas crack turned out so good so good florence's boyfriend was like this is amazing and i was like thank you <laughs> I work so hard but um it turned out so good um i didn't did i show you i don't remember you guys i'm sorry i don't think i did i'll show you in the morning it it turned out really good but i'll have the recipe linked down below and i'll have carol's channel linked down below because i really would love if you guys checked out her channel she i just really really love her videos i, I really really love them okay so i gotta finish her my sister-in-law's talking and then like i'll do the shopping for trevor and then uh and then I'm done. Oh, and I wrapped gifts all afternoon. I didn't show you because like they were in like actual packaging. You know what I mean? But anyways, let's do our puzzle and then I'll see you tomorrow. So I guess I'm gonna end just here. Uh, I'll end with a clip of the puzzle, but 14. I'll miss you, I'll miss you so much. <laughs> I'll see you tomorrow. Oh. Also, what's going on with my videos? What's happening? They're not showing up in my feed until the next day. The amount of people who have messaged me and said, your video is not up. And I'm like, yes, it is. It's up. And I have comments on it. But like, but if you like go to my actual like profile on like, uh, or my channel, I guess on YouTube, it doesn't show my newest video. It shows my second newest as my newest for two days now. So I don't know why it's doing that. I have, no, I have no idea, but my videos are going up every day at 10. It's just, I don't know whether or not you see them. Some people are seeing them and some people aren't. Anyway, let's do our puzzle. I'll see you guys tomorrow for Vlogmas Day 15. Bye.
making our Christmas memories I've been working so much lately I can barely find the time to sleep Yeah, I spend my time running around Keeping people pleased But this is my favorite holiday It's a chance to start over new Cause I missed you so I'm letting go of everything but you These are the good